Hello ladies and gentlemen, yes, Zeke here again today to bring you another episode of Let's Play Nuclear Throne Daily Runs. So, starting with the warm-up run as Rebel, because I feel like playing as Rebel. Um, I, I've kind of liked Rebel recently. I'm not good with Rebel. Um, the very opposite, really, I'm quite bad with Rebel. I've already gotten hit once, almost twice, twice. Um, so, as you can see, I'm just about all ready for the old ball game. I'm um, going to be using the screwdriver here temporarily to try to conserve my fairly low ammo funds. At least the portal will somewhat heal me. Ugh. Didn't get to summon any of my allies there. So, basically, the strategy with, um... With... With Rebel is to, at some point when you need them, summon a whole bunch of allies and use them to kill everything. Um, Throne Butt makes the allies fire faster, and they can really deal out quite a bit of damage, especially if you, like, put them facing a boss or just drop them during a boss and hide behind a corner. They'll kind of follow you, but it doesn't really matter, as most people will actually tell you. Um, I'm currently taking the screwdriver to see if I can get a golden weapon, and I will definitely, definitely take back muscle, which drastically increases my, my ammo drops. Oh, God, not one of these with like the endless bullets from behind the endless bullets from behind the endless bullets it's like the, the empty walls but with a lot more bullets oh Jesus there's four of them over there I've already killed two you're dead already you were not the problem in this situation these guys are the goddamn problem I'm not doing the daily run yet just to let you guys know this, this is um, a warm-up round so I'm gonna ditch the screwdriver. I know I said I would take it, and I know I'm playing as a character and not using his secondary ability, but I keep being in kind of rough situations. You gotta forgive me. Like, you don't have to. Nobody has to forgive me for anything, but I, I would appreciate if you would forgive me. Um, didn't have any options I really liked there. I prefer to just stay out of the way of um, explosions rather than become immune to them at a certain level of low health. Although it does stop explosions from actually straight up killing me, so can't complain too much, I guess. And, you know, slugger um, crossbow, pretty good combination. Combination for the Aegis. For the Aegis. Aegis. Aegis? Uh, how do you... Aegis Dynamics? I don't know what I'm talking about. Um, there's a sewer in case I get an explosive weapon in here. But recently, I haven't been getting many explosive weapons, so I don't expect them. Maybe they've been patched to have a lower rate of appearing, appearance rate, I guess, or drop rate, spawn rate, whatever you want to call it, rate. Can you guys just leave me alone? Like, hey, rat man, leave me the fuck alone. Okay, flame shotgun, probably better than slugger in this case. These are all so bad. Okay, I guess I'll take sharp teeth. Um, the advantage of sharp teeth is that I can damage people by summoning my allies. Which, oh no. This, this is, this is catastrophic, guys. I'm not sure if I like this very much at all. Okay, at least I have the fire shotgun now. Flame shotgun, I guess it is actually called. The double flame shotgun is much better, but the flame shotgun is still pretty goddamn awesome. I realized that I could have gotten a shotgun specific power up there. Don't have the screwdriver anymore. Don't need to con preserve that thing's life. Really? That missed? You gonna do me dirty like that game? The game's got me doing dirty like that. Okay, so I get some extra shells there. I'm up to 84 ammo with the flame shotgun, so that's not about to run out anytime too soon. I really don't like this setup. In, in terms of, I, I like the setup in terms of weapons. What I don't like is the setup as far as, um, so, as far as mutations go, okay, you guys both gotta die. And then I've gotta get your ammo. Me ammo. Not your ammo, me ammo. Um, so I think my best route of attack well, is actually to let these guys fly at me. Like the bros they are. There is a med kit there that I could really... Okay, you know what? Here. Some of my allies, they will take care of all the things for me. Um, I'll get them healed eventually. 
Oh no, what have I just done? Why did I do that? Okay, one of them dropped a med kit. They can actually drop items. These guys are dead. Oh, bad play makes me wonder how I'm still alive. These guys are both gonna be firing upwards. Oh, Jesus. Okay, I gotta wait for the birds to come to me. Or maybe I don't, I don't know. What do you guys think? Probably not, yeah, that seems about right. Okay, I'm still alive. Fuck if I know how. Doesn't even matter how hard I try, keep that in mind, and the fuck is fuck. This opportunity comes once in a fuck time. Okay, I could summon one ally there. I don't know if he actually draws aggro. I'm assuming he does, because if not, what the fuck's the point? Gotta move fast, gotta keep on going. I do not like this at all, guys. Oh, I moved slightly too far. I have a really hard time with those fine controls. Okay, either way, time to go do the daily run. That was just a warm up round for me. Hopefully I can perform better. I was, I had like a really sharp incline of skill where I, I knew what I was doing and it was really awesome. And then suddenly I got a lot worse. So I'm trying to get back to the point where I was. I'm trying to experiment a tiny bit to see what I'm doing wrong compared to what I was doing right. And so far I have found out absolutely nothing. So it, that's been really helpful for me. So the reason I ate the um, pistol before I picked up the assault rifle is that I don't really want extra bullets. I'd rather extra whatever the hell the melee weapon feels like giving me. I will instantly take rabbit paw because it is one of the game winning mutations. And um, I'm always good with game winning mutations. It's like rabbit's paw, back muscle, scarier face are just generally considered like the best mutations in the game. Like the best mutations. Not actually the best mutations, just somewhat like them. Machine gun is coming down with me. I don't need more um, bullet ammo, so I'm just gonna eat that. And I'm gonna eat that with my offhand weapon being a melee weapon. Machine gun again, oh my god. Why you gotta do me like this game? Surprisingly, I only got hit once there because I was really going balls out in terms of... You guys want to calm down a bit? Okay. Got in, didn't get hit too much. I seem to have taken one damage somehow, but I don't entirely know how. Now I could probably use some more um, bullets. Fortunately, I got some more there. I got soft more bullets. And no good weapons. Okay, interesting. I can take assault rifle down to the third floor. I'll take scarier face as well. Make sure I can kill enemies a bit faster. I, 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 it's comforting to think that other people are also dealing with this like all machine gun bullshit that's going on right now. Or all bullet bullshit. All bullet bullshit, bullet bullet bullshit, bullet bullshit, bullet bullet bullshit. I, I don't know, I'm trying to sing a song now. As you may or may not know, I am actually the piano man, so I am contractually obligated to sing you a song. Okay, let's get rid of that little explodey poison barrel. Don't know what that's actually supposed to be, because I have never in my life shot a barrel and seen it explode into poison gas. Until this game, of course. Is it, what, is it like rat poison? Are people trying to poison the rats? I don't blame them. Looking rats are bullshit. Like look at how much damage I just took. It's all rats. And I can't get in there because this guy keeps summoning more of them. What an ass. And there is me almost dying. Fortunately they dropped a shit ton of HP. Rabbit's paw helps. Assault slugger is one of the best weapons in the game. It kills bosses so goddamn fast. The thing is, I have to have a second weapon too because it also eats through ammo so goddamn fast. Me ammo even. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and go with um, Plutonium. No, I'm gonna go with Open Mind. I know Plutonium Hunger is one of the best in the game, but officially speaking, it's not necessary. Like if you can do without it, it's a, it's an advantage to you. That that's the thing. That's the the fascinating thing. 
I get so fascinated with you. Okay, I'm at max shells. I probably should be using something other than this machine gun. But I need something else that kind of conserves ammo. Something that's higher damage. Like a crossbow or something. But you know, this is a good this is a good seed. If you can get far enough to get that crossbow, I saw you, you fucking asshole. Okay, I'm going to eat the slugger. I'm going to eat the flame shotgun. I need the bullets more than anything. Oh, I thought I I thought I saw that. Hmm. I thought I saw that thing lick its lips. Apparently I was mistaken. Where are you, bird? Harvey Birdman, attorney attorney at guns? I don't know. I don't know what it is. Um, I'm gonna go with second stomach. It actually really helps with with robot's second ability since when he heals it counts as him healing using his um using his using a med kit. I should maybe be more specific there. When he heals using his throne butt ability or his um, right click ability, it heals as if he's used a med kit. So it does change the healing from that from two to four. Which is real good, because that gives you a self-heal in case of emergencies. Super crossbow. And shovel. Shovel's really good. Super crossbow just... I, I can't... I can't. I can't stand losing. I can't. I can't. I can't stand losing. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't stand losing you. I, oh, Jesus. You guys are just all coming over here, huh? Well, you know, I'm fine with that. This does put me at the advantage. Advantage, Yesik. Fight. I don't know. No game does that. Calls out the advantage before it starts the fight. Fuck games am I playing? Okay, I don't exact. I know where Big Dog is now. I didn't for a little while. I did see him out of the corner of my eyes. Somebody unfortunately seems to have aggroed. No! He came out of left field. This was such a good run. Oh, I... Yeah. Well, I'm gonna try again, not on the daily. I'll give you guys an entertaining run at least. I am rank 187 at the moment. I'll probably be doing much worse after a while. But let's actually go robot again. I love robot. I, I would, if I was in this game, I'd marry robot. You know how it is. It doesn't have a sex. You could probably be either if you want to, or she, for that matter. Or maybe he does have a sex. Maybe they like wrapped it on a big robot dick. Could be. I don't know. But if you're a robot with a dick, I guess it's pretty much the same as getting a sex change. So, you know, pretty much genderless. But then if you think about it that way, pretty much everybody is genderless if you consider that at any point they could try to get a sex change. I guess it's not that easy. Like, you have to jump through a lot of goddamn hoops. Interesting though, laser pistol. I will eat this and take the la- oh no! Hey man, I gotta shoot you in the face, I said. Hey man, because you are a disgrace, I said. <laughs> oh, that is hard to decide. I think I want to scare your face here instead of throne butt. Although, that that is very, very difficult to survive, or to decide. Oh, I'm loving this um, shot. Shotgun with scarier face is actually surprisingly good. Because you just bounce the, the shells into anywhere and eventually everything will die. Laser rifle. Laser pistol just fires slower and laser rifle has worst aim. Worst aim. Worst aim. Brat worst aim. I'm going to keep the pistol for now. Are you still just hanging out up there, dude? You're just still hanging out up there, huh? Like one bullet gets through out of all the bullets he fires. Is not the most intelligent of bosses. Just hanging out on the wall, having yourself a party. Hanging out, hanging out, hanging out with your family, having yourself a party. Laser brain. I am just a brain, lasering other brains with pain, with pain. And I go insane, singing this damn song. La oh, I ran into the way of that. You really got to watch out for those assassins since they can come out of fucking left field. Scarier face makes them awake all the time. Just in case you guys did not know that. Ooh, a toxic launcher. So now I have to keep an eye out for the sewer. I don't want to take the toxic launcher with me. I'd rather eat it. 
or beat it, just beat it. But I need to, um, you weren't the last person, were you? No, you were not. Actually, one of these things exists and I took so much damage there. Oh, thank you, game. You've corrected my mistake for me, my missed stake. Okay, I'll, I'll keep this guy alive while I search for this exactly. And then I will very quickly eat this to get some extra shotgun ammo. I can deal with losing my shotgun more than I can deal with losing my laser, so I'm gonna take this shotgun or this with me. And then I'm gonna stick it to the coroner. All this experience is gonna fly towards me. I will then eat this, eat the grenade launcher, take the shotgun, and move on. Move the on. Move. Roll on. How's that song go? I completely forget. I would actually rather go for a second stomach than. Ah, fuck. These three are all incredibly tempting. I'm gonna go with Bloodlust, actually. I think it recovers quite a bit of health for you over time. And you're bound to take some damage. It's not like you're safe from damage at any point. Wasn't here an assault rifle? I can't. Oh no, what? Was he in the chest? I didn't see him. Okay, fuck it, I'll do another one. Oh, that one run was really good too. I just fucked up my vision. It didn't work. By the way, I have new glasses coming that have an anti-glare coating. That have anti-glare coating. And um, those will probably diminish the amount you can see me in the computer, or see the computer in my eyes. Also, these ones, I have got something on them at some point that ate through, like, the first layer of them. And, um, yeah, th they're kind of wrecked. I, can, I can't see as well as I should. Uh, but actually, I almost failed my driver's test because after the driver's test, I had an eye exam and I couldn't do any of the depth perception things. Mostly because I just couldn't see out of my glasses properly when when small letters were in question. Oh no! Okay. Uh, I should not have taken that last damage. That was just disappointment damage. I will, however, take the sledgehammer and grab the two HP on the way down. Rabbit's Paw's first mutation is a really good thing to get because it kind of carries you throughout the entire game. And um, please ignore all the damage I'm taking. I see that uh, thing of experience there, by the way. I just don't care about it yet. So the main strategy with Big Bandit here is just to kind of make him fire one volley and then get out of the way and then you can keep firing at him as long as... There we go. All that experience is belong to me. Then you can get out of the way and just keep firing at him until he dies. And you can pretty much do that in one session with almost any weapon. If you can get the beat on him anyways. Um, yeah, I'll, um, I'll do this. Max HP. That's not what I wanted. That's not what I what I wanted. I almost want to mutate later. I know some people like sharp teeth. I really don't. A lot of people like impact wrist, and it is good. And bloody bloody lust is good too. Give me, give me some healing. It's almost always worth getting some healing. I find that when I die in this game, it's generally because I'm low on health. Tell me, you guys, you guys can tell me if you have had different experiences, but I'm pretty sure that is essentially it. Ooh. Dreams are made winding through your head. At least that's what this song reminds me of. What's that called again? It's a system of a Down song. And through my head. It's in a different, it's definitely in a different key. Let's um, grab some shells. I have full crossbow ammo right now, so there's not really any point to getting more crossbow ammo, which is why I'm eating the reverse thing of what. You, usually I'd eat the other way around. That's how I would snack. And that's the way, uh-huh, uh-huh, I snack it. Uh-huh, uh-huh. There we go, that was the last rat. I'm pretty bad rats if you ask me. I'm going to take second stomach here again. I'm trying to with the theory that plutonium hunger, while it is very, very useful, it's actually better if you don't have it as long as you don't kill yourself to go get rads. Because instead of having 
instead of having plutonium hunger, you could have something that actually has a direct effect on your killing power or your healing power. I guess you could say it does have a direct effect on the healing power just because of, because you might as well be walking on the sun. Oh my god, that was four kills in one hit. That was um, one assassin in one hit. I didn't even know it was there until it was too late. 10 energy, fortunately it did the right thing even though I ate the wrong way. Ate the wrong way. Beware of what he eats, he'll surely go straight to hell. I forget what the song is called, Bad Businessman. Well, no, I forget, I don't forget what the song's called, it's called Bad Businessman. Clearly. Wait, if you guys are jazz fans, especially kind of like old school Django jazz, the Squirrel Nut Zippers are a modern band, but they are very, very good at what they do, and what they do is, that was really stupid. I didn't know what he was, I couldn't see him properly. I'm gonna restart again. I want at least one run that gets to the ice levels, or else I will feel very, very disappointed in myself. Disappointed at best. By the way, almost 90% of what I say, even if it doesn't sound like it, is a song re reference. Like, that was an MSI reference. Mindless self-indulgence. There, there are bands I cycle through, but there are other bands or just bad music that I also reference in terms of, you know, all the time. I'm definitely gonna try to get homing bolts because it is essentially one of the best upgrades in the game. If you have any bolt item, including, including, include, oh no, 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 no. Oh, that was so bad. I'm including the splinter gun. Splinter gun, homing bolt, surprisingly good. Okay, might as well take the machine gun. It's pretty much better than the revolver in every way. I think it has very slightly lower accuracy, but nothing worth writing home about. Ah, you were just in the opposite direction, huh? Take me to the next level. There we go. And also out to the ball game. No particular reason. I just think you. I deserve a date with you, whoever you are that I'm currently talking to. Oh God. <laughs> Back against the wall right there. Um, I don't feel like dealing with you right now, big bandit. You can just um, piss off temporarily. All right, go Toxic Bow. Gives me two more HP. That's kind of unfortunate. I was very slightly hoping for, you know. What was I very slightly hoping for? Where is big bandit? Where'd he go? Where is this asshole? I'm not gonna know until he starts shooting at me, am I? There, whoa, whoa. Let's have more bolts, a few more bullets. I want to get rid of the machine gun pretty soon, but for now I will go with throwing butt. By the way, um, that reload time increase is actually really good as well, especially with something high damage like um, the crossbow, for instance. Because that means the second you get a kill, you can shoot again, which really lowers your reload time. If you have the heavy crossbow, it's fucking astounding, because you can get several kills with one shot, I guess you can with the regular bow as well. But it kind of does wonders for the skin. Ah, I'm not sure why I said for the skin. I need to deal with that assassin really quick before he wakes up or before he stops pretending to be asleep. Stop right now. Thank you very much. I need somebody with less ratty touch. Oh, laser rifle, huh? Ah, see, you're treating me well, game on this run. You want me to succeed as well. The game's kind of stacking it in my favor and I am um, just fucking up. Let's leave you alive. Okay, are you the last one alive? I think you might be. So let's um, shoot this down here and then do that. Oh, there was one more person alive. Just gonna make sure there was no one else, okay. No experience trapped behind a wall. Might as well eat the toxic launcher because toxic weapons are just real bad. And have a drink of water. Since I have thrown butt, I don't really need rhino skin or rabbit's paw. So I'm going to go scare your face. And I know it keeps killing me with those fucking assassins, but if I can get past the assassins, if I can get past the Thunderdome. There we go, max bullets for everything. Not really interested in using energy items. Actually, in all honesty, what I would like is to have, um, double double bow type weapons like a heavy crossbow or a super crossbow oh super crossbow for big rooms 
fucking best time of your life. It's so, there's something unpredictable, but in the end, it's just right. I, I just hope you have the time of your life. Oh, no! Wow. Um, I'm gonna eat this to, yeah, I got some more HP back. Uh, that, that was real bad. And I realized I just ate a laser rifle for some more health, but it's better than dying, or than being in a one hit to die situation. Christ. Dem assassins. Really the best way to deal with these birds is to just, um, wait for them to come to you, but sometimes that doesn't seem like the best option. There we go, killed both of you. You get your wall blown up, and pretty much everyone else blown up as well at the same time. Yeah, that seems about right. And, you know, I got to level five there. I got um quite a bit of experience. I got back up to seven health. I'd call that a win. And I also take Rhino Skin, which is a pretty major coup for me. Oh no, no, what, they're behind me. Oh shit. No, 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 no. No 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 my baby my baby let me go because you love me my baby let me go No police that is astounding to me. That was one of the most stressful moments I've ever had in this game. Let's go up here, see what is in here. A pop gun. That is some good edibles. <laughs> no, you fucking don't, game. I don't care what you want to happen here. That's not gonna fucking happen. Unless you want me to win. I have been saying that you were stacking the odds in my favor. But then you keep giving me a bunch of these bullshit rooms. And I gotta blow up the cars. Um, laser is actually really good against this guy because you can hit through the missiles and destroy them as well as hit him. Let's get behind here really quick. All the experience should come to me. And um, there's my second bow weapon but it sucks. And what's in here? Auto shotgun. Still not really worth it. I am at 12, 12 health. I have scarier face. I have a crossbow. I have homing bolts. I should be fine to move down to the next floor. Down to the next floor with you. Oh, there is definitely people down. Oh no! I hate it when crossbows do that. Sometimes the hit detection on them just is not that good and you put a bolt straight through somebody and it doesn't hit. Fortunately, um... Scarier face makes it possible to kill these guys in two hits instead of three. Saving a lot of resources for me. There we go. Get my experience. Find your weapon crate. I'm so fine finding weapon crates. I am so fine in weapon crates. You don't even know, man. Oh, Jesus. This is a room that I do not like. It is a room that I like considerably more right now. I'm gonna take the plasma gun because it has a nice AOE tied to it. Um, and probably strong spirit at this point. I realize a lot of people are yelling at me to take rabbit paw, but I can't really justify it when I have no ammo concerns and no health concerns, and me ammo concerns as well. There we go, grab a couple of these into the wall. One car explosion, for your mind. Kill you. I'm glad they both died rather easily. And probably extra bull extra bullets. I don't need that. Can you like stop doing this crazy fucking circle straight or straight from hell? There we go. Finally managed to time that correctly. The problem is I appear to be running out of um, crossbow bolts because it keeps giving me fucking bullets. Which is as as you may or may not have guessed, unideal. Let's blow that up, kill this guy, get some crossbow bolts, please. There we go. Got a double kill there and quite a few bolts. And whoa, you're way off. Man. Fortunately, he died way over there, which allows me to come and get this weapon, which is a plasma rifle. Sounds better than a plasma gun. 
I do say so myself. Now I gotta watch out for the IIPD. Um, I'm gonna go with a better accuracy. Not sure if it'll do anything for me, but it, it can be good in the future if you have like an auto crossbow or an auto anything, really. Oh, I need, I need that health now. Bitch, I look like Goku. Ever, ever look up that song? Or ever um, hear that song? It's a great song. It's called Bitch, I Look Like Goku. It's pretty much um quadruple machine gun. I don't care, I want the HP. It's a lot of machine gun, I must admit. I must confess, I confessed? Confess, I'm machine gunning you, machine gunning you. You seriously didn't give me any um fucking no, oh god. I just summoned the police on myself. Are you gonna kill yourself? You can't kill yourself, huh? Oh my god, that that was a sniper shot. I can't even be mad. I want to kill this. So I don't lose that experience. I really don't want to deal with the IIPD in the next level where one of the hardest bosses in the game is. And I would really like some better weapons. Like, I realize I have decent weapons, but they're not better. Blood Ken. That is an explosive weapon that is kind of shitty. Okay, where did all those guys go? They're there, and... See what I mean about sometimes the hit detection just being way the fuck off? It happens, man. It happens so bad, it's driving me mad. Oh, no you don't. Clear a space and don't die. So I just used up my life. Um, I need this health. What the fuck? No, 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 no. They've really got to balance how many people, like I started in a place where I could not fight this guy. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, please like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.